in the previous video concerning Rob's toenail. Rob was losing the nail on his big toe. It seems as though I'm losing my big toenail on my left foot. Is that from hiking the Appalachian Trail three months ago? And rather than have a podiatrist remove it like a normal human being, he decides to take matters into his own hands or foot and yank it out. Similar to pulling out a loose tooth, but not tying it to a doorknob. He shapes a 12 pound rock into a toe, ties it to his toenail and tosses it off a bridge. No one said Rob was sane or not crazy. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> this totally just solidifies it. So in this video, by request, Rob will show the creation of the toe sculpture and all the components that it took to pull off this toenail stunt, literally. Now, the story of how Rob found the rock. processors that was a flipping bomb or an asteroid i think we just witnessed a meteorite uh. this has got to be the most amazing thing i've ever had in my life it's got to be over here somewhere holy crap there's 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 a smoke this is crazy there no aliens from space. Come on, Rob. This could be the toe. Hey, I saw that meteor first. I'm gonna get that money. Oh, no. oh I broke my leg. Get back here, that's my meteorite. Looking at this glorious rock, I've decided to use CACs, cheap ass chisels, because I don't know what I'm doing here. So let's try. Oh, that just hit me in the cojones. It's like going back in time. This as far as where I'm at. Now I've drawn some lines. So now it is time to smooth this little piggy out and I tried this grout removing bit which was a poor choice. As for the grinder, I'm vibing with the grinding. This is a cutoff wheel, primarily for metals and plastics. I decided to use it on meteorite and it works super well. The other side can be used to detail sand. I just want to show you the pro toe type that I've created for supporting my leg on this daring venture. This hangs over the railing of the bridge. This hangs down on the side of the railing, holding my foot that will be strapped in. I'm showing you this because I'm trial running it and I used a cork. In that cork, I sliced the side because I want to insert these cool little lady slipper shells that I thought symbolized toenails very well in to the cork. Tied to a rope, the rope is tied to the toe sculpture. I will throw that over the bridge and then 
Hopefully that's how it works. Please. This is the trial run. Bricks will sub for the toe sculpture, cork for the real toe, and shell for the nail. Yes, it works! Here, I am drawing dots on the nail. Why? You will soon find out. What is this popsicle stick for? It's a barrier for this. I'm gonna drill those dots and make holes. And I surely don't want to go through that toe. Oh, that's so sensitive. Ali is now painting my nail. We're drawing it out first. We've drilled it, and now it is time to apply paint. Beautiful job, Ali. Thank you. This little piggy is done. Let's get a closer look. If you haven't watched the toenail video yet, do it! Tap the thumbnail for the toenail, please.